Um, our next poet has been shaking since 6.30. So let's welcome Sara Biotti. Um, I'm going to read a poem in English. It's called On the Ground. Okay? Uh, if you don't like it, you don't have to clap. Okay? Um, resting on the ground, smelling that pungent, earthy smell of dirt around me. Something about it was relaxing, knowing that I've fallen and can't plummet down further. The corner of my eye was telling me that the world was still moving around me, which is perfectly fine. When you're on the ground, all you want is for the world to keep moving and for you to just watch it go by. But alas, that wasn't accepted from me. I couldn't even rest for a moment. Though every inch of me was sore and striving for a moment's peace, somehow I was expected to function like everybody else. It's not like the world is full of humans who have compassion. A little experience in life will teach you otherwise. Though the tears were still flowing down like a river, I managed to function like a very badly oiled machine that shrieks with the turn of every gear. Between the screams around me, asking me to fulfill my duties and the lack of friendly faces, I still quite don't know which is worse. After what seems like days later, I finally heard a familiar voice, unexpected as it was, it was you, but I couldn't let you see the scars. Uninvited, you rested next to me, and I found myself spilling my pain. Almost uncontrollably, the words seemed to come out of my mouth. As always, you listened and listened and listened. It was strangely comforting. And while I know you didn't stretch up an arm to help me, I'm suddenly sitting on the ground instead. Thank you.